When we deliver the goods, please assist the carpenter to spray out the product entirely and assist the carpenter during inspection. First, whether the item numbers are consistent or not. Second, whether products are defective or not. Third, whether there is any controversy of the connection of the product with carpenter or not. Based on all these points, detailed examination should be done on site. When there is no problem with the inspection, the packing list can then be given to the carpenter to sign receiving of items. After the carpenter received the item, he should first measure the correct size that he needs and then mark on its surface of the size need. After marking, use a strip plank and a sharp knife. It is suggested to use a new knife for the cutting. When cutting can't be finished with one cut, a second cutting is needed. However, they will easily damage the surface of the product. Dude, it's best to complete the cutting with one cut. If the needed area is at edge, needed is used by side. He can use a chair ray to decorate cutting edge to avoid it seeing of scrub edge from the cutting. During cutting, the carpenter can use cut about half millimeter longer than actual size, then use chair ray to finish it. After cutting, the reverse size of product must be cleaned. Then apply white glue on reverse side and spread white glue evenly. With a scaper, according to the carpenter's habits, spread white glue evenly on the reverse side of product. During spreading, it is suggested that there is not a cluster of glue. It's best if it's evenly smooth and thick, so it won't give a um, net during attachment. When spreading the white glue on edge, please mention to the carpenter to try to spread the glue carefully and not to let glue go onto the surface of the product. After applying glue onto the reverse side of product, also apply white glue on the base seat where you want to attach the item. Spray white glue evenly on the base. After applying white glue onto the base, attach the item, which white glue had been applied on earlier, directly onto the glue base. During attachment, start with one side first. After the side is set, use both hands to adjust the item into correct position. Whether there is moving up or down, go right or left. Then attach the item evenly on bed side. When the product is attached onto the bed set, use a board or roller brush with a pressing motion to slowly press out any air bulb that may be produced during attachment. First, it can press out the air completely so it will not create budget filling. Second, it can help the glue to attach better. All of above are the working practice of this collection. If there is any question of our product or working practices, please contact with our sales unit. Thank you.